Hi, Len. First of all, welcome to Celtic. Um, you've been you know, awarded a five and a half year deal here. Like Liz mentioned, you're 24. Are you looking to you know, really kick on here and show what you're all about? Uh, first of all, thank you. And yes, of course, I want to stay here now. And uh, yeah, I want to I want to show what I'm capable of. And uh, as I said before, I want to I want to excite the fans and have a nice of nice of couple of years here and nice moments with the fans together. Also, we mentioned to you um, a couple of times that Celtic's a club where anything but a win is unacceptable. You have said you've played under that kind of pressure before at Vienna and Ajax. Is this something that you came into and you thrive off of this pressure? Do you feel like you perform better under this kind of, you know, walk? Yeah, I like those kind of pressure. Uh, of course, of course, uh, the fans and everyone uh, knows that that you normally ha have to win and you want to win. It's not always uh, easy as that, but um, yeah, at the end, it's all about winning. Obviously, Celtic have a big second half of the season coming up with um, the Scottish Cup, obviously the game on Sunday, and then the league still to play for. Will you be looking to, you know, show how important you can be to clinching these trophies and obviously starting off your career at Celtic in the best possible way? Yeah. I don't know what's the plan for this weekend, but uh, but I'm in training now. I feel good, and uh, yeah, maybe it's gonna take a week longer. Um, I'm gonna I'm gonna see that I will fit in here now, and uh, yeah, arrive, and then uh, yeah, I hope I can show as soon as possible. Welcome to Celtic. As Celtic has a reputation, you have for much talent and help players reach the next level in their career. What aspects of your game are you hoping Brendan Rodgers can help you with and reach the next, next level? Yeah, of course. Uh, as, I, as I said before, uh, I talk with him a lot. And uh, he he told me like to bring me in those kind of situations and in the dangerous areas of the pitch. So I can I can even have more scores. So that's that's an important thing for me. And uh, he wants to support me and help me. And at the end, I have to do it then. You look like a quite a creative player from what I've read and watched of you. How much are you looking forward to setting up players like Kyogo on the pitch? Uh, excuse me, what? You look like quite a creative player. Yeah. How, much are you, yeah. how excited are you to set up players like Kyogo on the pitch? Yeah, of course. I think uh, with, with great players beside you, you have uh, more opportunities. You have uh, you have uh, just a stronger team. You is for the for the opponent. Of course, it's much more dangerous to to don't know from where the danger is coming. If you have uh, a lot of players with big quality, then it makes everything easier. You won the Fritz Walter gold medal. Long players have won that with Peter Park and Alex Stegen, Tony Rudiger and Kai Havertz. How significant achievement was that for you in your career so far? Yeah, it was. It was, of course, a nice, a nice uh, thing for me and for my family. Um, I didn't, I didn't really see it as pressure or something. Uh, for me, it was just, just uh, how do you say? It, it was recognition. Of, yeah, can you say recognition. It? Yeah. Yeah, um, for what I did in the in the youth, and uh, yeah, I think that that shows that. There's a lot of talent and quality there, so I have to bring it on the pitch. Have you received any advice from former teammates or former coaches about joining Celtic? Not really. I just I just talked with my my manager. He told me a lot about uh, Scotland and uh, of course Celtic as well. And he said it was one of his best times here, and yeah, so we had good talks. Have you watched any Celtic games in recent weeks? I saw some some Celtic games. The last one, the three three nil, I saw as well, or I tried to, uh, because it's not that easy to get it in Germany. But uh, yeah, I tried to follow some games, also the Champions League games I saw, and yeah, of how course you, I, yeah, I really want to come. How do you just your style of play to fans that maybe haven't watched you before? 
What do you mean? Uh, what, how would you describe the way that you play to fans that haven't seen any videos or matches before? Yeah, a really creative player. I love to come over the speed, get behind the, the big line, uh, take one on ones, one on twos. And uh, yeah, I, I love to, to excite the fans, not just, uh, how you say it? It's also to give the fans something, you know? Would you say crossing's a big part of your game? When looking at EF, it's noticed you've got very special crossing statistics, particularly in the Austrian Bundesliga. Yeah, of course. I like to cross as well, but uh, I also like to cut inside and uh, search for a good pass or or dribbling on the shot. Hi, Nick. Welcome to Celtic. Um, what would you like to have achieved here by the time you leave the club? Of course, we want to win every game there is. And uh, yeah, it's going to be step by step. And... Uh, I want to I want to be in the Champions League of course that's that's a goal and yeah uh, who were some of your footballing idols for that? I think it was always uh, Messi for me I love the dribbling also left footed and uh, yeah it was always Messi maybe Ronaldinho as well yeah and um, when you score I've noticed you've got a trademark celebration is there anything behind that? Um, I do with the player. He's now at PSV Eindhoven, Noah Lang. Yeah. So first it was a it was a L for him, but now it switched uh, to the first letter of my dad, like the Y. How you say? Y. Yeah. And um, Celtic haven't had any German players that have made a massive impact in the club. Um, how much would you like to change that? Of course, I want to change it then. Uh, I knew the Marvin Komper was here. They told me about. I played with him at Leipzig. Oh, we trained a lot together in the first team there. And yeah, I want to do better then. Thank you. Good luck. Thanks. Is that everybody? Oh, sorry. Get a microphone here. Hi, Nick. Welcome to Celtic. Thanks. How much are you looking forward to the Champions League nights at Celtic Park? Yeah. The people here told me about the special nights uh, in the U European nights, so uh, I'm really looking forward to it and can't wait to have one of those nights. Thanks.